Hey everybody, welcome to a Player Unknown's Battlegrounds video. Today we're going to be playing solo. I know my past two videos have been uh, with my friends, but today we are going solo. We are parachuting down. So my buildings are having a little bit of trouble rendering in, but hopefully they'll come in soon. If I have to, I'll pretty much just hide, and that's what it looks like I'll be doing. Yeah, this doesn't look very good. Okay, so things are starting to render in, and there is a gun, which is good. Even though I'm a minute late to the action, I at least found a gun right away so I could protect myself. So, I'm going to be looting this building, I guess, for things like motorcycle helmets, chokes, if I get a shotgun, and ammo. Okay, so it looks like the circle is pretty much centered around Pachinski, and there is a site for the M4, and I did pick up a little bit of armor, so we're doing pretty good. Found some painkillers earlier, so we're not off too bad, but we will have to head out of this town near Pachinski kind of soon. Whoop, and there is some more ammo and a gun. So that's pretty good. I'll have at least two guns now in case I spray all my ammo, miss all of them. I'll have a backup gun just in case, or if I'm shooting at pass, passing cars and they jump out at me, I'll have a second gun. And there are shots in the houses next to me, and I still do need another sight for my other gun, but I do need to be careful. I hear footsteps close by, so I need to be careful of those. So there, there's a guy on the street. Ah, I was just one second to, like, to take shots at him. So I guess we could see what is going on. Maybe we can get him. I think he's in here. The oh, oh, we find him. Bam, dead. Okay, close the door, close the door, close the door. I don't want anyone else coming. Okay, there we go. Okay, we seem safe. We're about half health. I'm going to take those painkillers considering they're literally the only thing I have on me right now. It should heal me up pretty good, though. It'll just take a little bit. But let's see what this guy has. He doesn't have a single thing that I need, so that's kind of bad, but it's okay. But there are footsteps near me. Do need to be careful of those. And I think we're just going to keep going. I really don't need to get into another fight. And I think these footsteps are in this building, actually. So I'm going to go ahead and run away and never return. Alright, I hear cars and shots very close by. I'm going to quickly take a look at those. Maybe I can do something about them. And at the same time, try not to get myself shot. There could be pretty much anybody anywhere. And there are some shots in front of me. There are also some behind me. Now what I'm doing is kind of dangerous. I'm walking out just kind of in the open field, but I think it'll be fine. Just got to make sure. I got to watch my corners. As long as I watch my corners, I'll be fine. So yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and keep going. If there are other people in like that kind of like village, they're going to have to come out this field also. And if they do, I do want to be the first one here so I can sit at the tree line and kill them just in case. And you never want to be the second because then you get shot. Oh, that was a shot. Wow, this scared the crap out of me. Whew. That hurt quite a bit. Yeah, that hit me directly in the armor. The problem is I have no healing supplies. Holy crap, that scared the crap out of me. Okay, I need to get going. There's a dude behind me that's kind of aiming. Ooh, more bandages. That's kind of aiming at me, and I need to get out of his way quickly. Now, hopefully he doesn't move forward very fast, because then I'll have to fight him. And I don't know what type of gun that was. Pretty sure it was just an assault rifle, but it could have been a car or an SKS. I'm not exactly sure. I didn't, I didn't hear it very well. Okay, so yeah, I need to get moving here. I do gotta watch my back. I wouldn't be surprised if he took a couple shots right here. And there's a shot. Okay, it. I think I think he has some type of sniper. Cause I'm not I'm not hearing him take multiple shots. It's just shots at a time. So it could be an SKS or an, a car. Gotta be careful though. Now I'm just gonna stay kind of in line with the tree and the hill. So maybe he won't be able to take shots. Cause he's he's from behind. So maybe if I kind of stay in, out of his line of sight, 
And I'm pretty sure I'm clear to go. I've got this hill right here to kind of cover me. Now, I do have to watch my back just in case. But there is a car here. So, I'm going to go ahead and take this. And move. Yeah, I really don't feel like fighting a sniper. So, I'm just going to go ahead and get moving. Okay, so I'm going to do something crazy. I'm going to try to drive through the water. Now, I'm not sure if this will work. But we're going to go ahead and... Ooh, that was way too close. I'm going to gonna go ahead and try if this fails i don't need the car but if it does work that would be kind of cool and surprisingly we made it that's crazy but now i pretty much have to drop off the car here so it's a win-win i guess i have an escape car but i'm not gonna really use it much but yeah let's go into these buildings and kind of hide out for a little bit we're not gonna go pachinski we're just gonna go to we're just going to stay here pretty much. This is the, almost the middle of the circle. So I'm going to find somewhere safe. And we're going to camp here. There is a guy over there. He just jumped off the balcony. <coughs> oh. Whew. Whew. Okay, that wasn't... <laughs> ah, this game scares the crap out of me. If you guys don't know what that is, it's kind of a glitch in the game where... It shows the damage animation and the sound, but you actually don't get hurt. I don't know why that happens, but that scared the crap out of me. I thought someone shot at me, but it wasn't a shot. So there was a guy over there. I don't know where he went. But I do got to watch out for him, though. So the circle's pretty good. Still pretty much in the middle, which is good. There are 42 alive, so a little under half. But still a good amount. Okay, so we're going to go from building to building here. Kind of looting... Kind of clearing the place out a bit, sort of. Okay, so 39 left. We're going to cross the street here. This might get me killed. But I'm really hoping these houses on this side aren't looted. Because it would give us a little bit more. I'm still kind of low on health supplies. Okay, so the circle is still in me. I'm still around the circle, but I am at the very edges, so I will have to move later on anyway. I might as well start moving towards the middle. And we're doing pretty good. 30, I was about to say 34. 33 left alive. We have two guns, a good bit of ammo, not too much. We're healing up a little bit. And yeah, now it's going to suck kind of running through these hills and mountains. But if I do it early enough, there shouldn't be really anyone to stop me. And if there is, I'll probably just shoot them. A station hut in front of me. And then after right here, it's pretty much, I just have to not get shot. It's not up to me right now. But it doesn't look like anyone's peeking or is very interested. So I think we're good. I'm going to pull out my other gun. I hear a car. But we're pretty much good. There is a car very close. Should be like right around this hill. I'm not going to go ahead and like directly challenge it, though, because it kind of scares me. And what did I... If I die because of this... Okay, we're good. We're good. Whew, that was scary. So there's a... Th some dude died here. Two people died here. Now, there is another person in this house. We're very close to here. So I'm just going to close that bad boy. And I'm going to loot here because... They have nothing. Never mind. I was hoping they'd have some type of ammo. But you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and get going. If there's a person in there, I don't feel like staying and fighting. Okay, I'm just going to take little little short peeks out. See if, seeing if there's anybody on the rooftops. Now, there's a car nearby. Probably moving around these apartments, scouting it out. But yeah, the main roof that I'm scared about is that one right there. Because it's the only one higher than me. So they're the only people that I won't be able to see, where they, but they can see me. Okay, so there is a car on the hill, and the circle is about to come in again. This next point might be the make or break of this game right here. Depending on where this is, this could do me very good or bad. Okay, that is something interesting. It's good, it's very close, but I really would have loved to stay in this building. But this does mean that, sadly, I will have to make my way out of this building. Which I'm not going to just yet. I'll... For once, I'm going to be the last. Now, first, what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait until everyone else kind of goes out, and then I'll just sneak behind and have a little bit of fun. 
So pretty much we gotta get going now. We got about 10 seconds, 15 people left alive. And now I'll be able to make it in the circle quite easily. Now the pro the real problem is gonna be going in the circle and staying safe. Now there is a back entrance, but I have heard footsteps around me, so I do gotta be careful. What I'm thinking is I'll go around the right side. I haven't heard many shots from there. And whatever shots there are, they're in the open field. I'll probably be able to pick them off. But I know there's people to my left because I hear the shots. So, uh, okay, we're going to have to start going here. And I'm just going to make a break for it. Again, hopefully everyone hears the shots at the left and kind of deals with them. I'm going to be going here. I do have a little bit of cover because I have these rocks and trees. Pretty much once I make it to those trees over there, I'm safe. Unless there's someone again to my right of me and the chances of that aren't very high. But since this hill is kind of giving me a little bit of cover and the new circle is just pretty much ahead of me i'm gonna stay to the far right here and if anyone else is on the far right they won't see me there are nine people left shots over here seven people left now i six i really like this groove right here this gives me a like nobody can see me from the top from the bottom, oh, there's nobody at my bottom. To the left, right, nobody can see me. This is a really good hill right here. But I ha we'll have to move forward a little bit. I might as well try to get in position. I'm look at those hills, make sure there's no one there. And there's probably going to be a person at this hut here, so I do got to be careful. Make sure. Check it out real quick. There's a dude right. How has he not heard me? What is wrong with him? Well, he's dead. Yeah, I, that, I wonder if that dude was wearing headphones. So there's a buggy up there, and considering he hasn't gotten shot, I don't think they have a view of me. Level 2, level 3 backpack, and then I'll take all his 5.56 five, ammo because both my guns and the pan, yes, and drop it, that pistol. So I think we're pretty good on the view. There are five people left. I'm gonna, I know it's kind of like the baby way out, but I'm going to try to let them fight it out. I don't want to bring too much attention to myself, and I do have really good cover here. Nope. I mean, hopefully someone doesn't do what I did, but I'll be smart enough to not let that happen. But for now, I just got to kind of watch in front of me, because I have view in front of me. People don't have a view. Oh, that is one shot at me. Whew. Never mind. People... Oh, something hit my pan. Oh, I need to move to a tree. Whew. My pan saved me, guys. I told you this pan is amazing. It saved me. And I'm right in the zone, but I should get moving here. There is five people left, meaning there's probably someone to my left and a couple people to my front. There's pretty much going to be a guy at pretty much every single one of these trees. And I know there's someone to the rock over there. There has to be. There's no way there's someone not at that rock. So if they start shooting, I'm going to have to be careful. There's also someone over there at that tree. I just saw some blood. And, oh wait, he's dead. Three people. Me, there is a guy in front of me. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to drink an energy drink to give me a speed boost and some regen. And then I'm going to book it. I have to book it for those trees up there. Because I do have to move forward because of the circle if you look at the mini-map. The bottom right. Three alive. So we're pretty close. We got two kills this game, which is not that bad. I mean, it's actually horrible. But, now I'm not exactly the most aggressive player now, am I? Okay, so I got to be careful. My main concern is the guy up ahead. The guy to the side, I can if I see him, I can pretty much dodge it, but Okay, so 20 20 seconds. Energy drink does only takes a couple seconds. So I'll probably maybe swig that and then just get going. But I'm going to wait a while. I'm going to let the guy to the side of me maybe run first, take the tension off of me. 6 seconds. Okay. Shots, that means they see each other, meaning this is, this is my time to move right now. I need to get going while he doesn't see me. Now, I'm going to stay over here for a second. Not going to be too hasty. I still got a little bit of time, but I do got to make it to this tree line right over here. And there are people to the sides. And Okay, so, oh, that that is shots. Oh, from my top of the hill. I'm not going to take shots yet. So that guy just killed a guy. So I know where he is. He doesn't know where I am. I probably could have taken a couple shots, but I'm going to play safe here. But he is at that tree over there. I don't know if he saw me. He might have. 
you've probably seen me now. I'm in the middle of the open. Let's see if I can bait a shot or two. Doesn't look like he's taking the bait. But the circle is drawing me near to him, meaning I will get pushed out here in a minute. I see him now. Okay, he knows where I am. He was looking at my exact tree. So this is going to be pretty much a headshot battle. I don't have a good helmet, which is going to really screw me over if he gets headshots. But 15 seconds, I'm going to take this energy drink, and I'm going to move out. Because if I take damage from the border, it will kill me. One. I got a good shots on him. Now it's time to rush. Spray and pray. And that is done. Rank one, guys. We won the solo. Three kills. Not too good. But I'm not an aggressive player. But yeah, that was fun, guys. We won. And that is my first victory, which is crazy. First, I've won duos and squads, but I've never won a solo. But guys, if you did enjoy it, make sure to like and comment as a support on the channel. And I'll see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.